All right, this is just a quick video showing off this Class 71 here, the Hornby. Um, it's a railways. One of the guys asked if they had a cab light, and yes, it does. Now, in the HM7000, of course, you can individually control the headlights, which the head codes are actually attached to. I thought they were separate, but they're not. So, there you go. That's on there. I'll turn it off again. Turn it back on. Now, of course, if we change direction, Uh, we need to actually move a little. That's changed to red. It's going the other way. She's actually creeping. And we'll change direction again. And we'll change back to white. Now, while she's moving slowly, I'll turn on the cab light. Hopefully you should be able to see it. Come on. There she is. Now, if she's on in there at the moment, if I change direction, it changed to the rear cab lights on. It's been hard to see over there. I'll try it. That's off. And there's it's on. I'll change back to forward. Now, I'm going to put the sound on now. The Class 71 sound file is not here at the moment. So I do have, a, I've got a diesel just for a bit of fun, just to have a bit of sound. But um, I did have the Class 73, but I actually got a Class 73 over there. So I wanted something different just to muck around. But um, here's automatic. Of course, it's not an electric. Yes, I know. Let's get it moving a little bit. And even though they're not the right sounds, let's, let's have a horn going. Okay, shut him down. And let's turn that cab light off. Oh, and you can see where I've removed the booster. I just put a bit of black cardboard there on the inside. Honestly, it just looks like a dark window into the engine compartment. It's absolutely fine, because that's where the HM7000 and the Stay Alive is. All right, bye.